Father, in Jesus' name, I honor and adore you. Thank you for today. Thank you for your love. Thank you for the gift of life and the gift of love. Thank you for blessing me with a wonderful man. Stars are tracing the sky like city windows. I watch you reflect in your eyes. And the Lord God said, It is not good for man that he should be alone. I will make him a helper comparable to him. Marriage is intended to bring glory to God. Now that is very sobering. So marriage reminds us of God's divine intention for creation. Relationship between Christ and the church. So I pray that your marriage will glorify God. Beyond the makeup, the gown, the flowers, the everything, Lord, I pray that you will receive all the glory. Glorify yourself today, Lord. <laughs> communication going on and on each and every day and also keep God first because without God um, nothing will ever stay together. I'm happy for you guys. Congratulations. Your big day is here. I wish you all the best. Uh, may your union be beautiful. May you have beautiful kids. You're an amazing girl. You're an amazing person with beautiful traits. Chris, you're an amazing person and you're good for each other. May you have the happiest of unions with God's blessings and yeah, congratulations. As you begin a new chapter in life, we should nothing but the best. Love you. And I know you'll make a wonderful couple. Congratulations. Love you. We are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony, which is commended of St. Paul to be honorable among all men. I want to talk to you, Judy and Christopher. I require and charge you both as you will account before the Lord at that dreadful day of judgment when the secrets of all hearts shall be disclosed that if either of you knows any impediment why you may not be lawfully joined together in holy matrimony that you do now confess it. Is there any impediment, Christopher? No, there's not. Amen. Can we appreciate that congregation? <laughs> Judy, to endele ama to see endele. Is there any impediment? No. Amen and amen. Wow. I, Christopher Karugu, take you, Judy Mbondo, to be my lawful wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better for us, in riches and in poverty. Standing with you in trials, rejoicing with you in victories, to love, to cherish, and to submit, till death do us part, according to God's holy ordinance. And thereto I give you my vow. Amen. Come on, let's appreciate amen and amen.